What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I stopped at a LGS today and I happened to pick up five Lord of the Rings Relics and Realms, Realms and Relics box toppers. Um, so I'm a hundred in on these five toppers and we're really going after Balin's Tomb, Party Tree. We pull a Balin's Tomb, we, we instantly double. Um, and today we're also going to do a set box. So we'll have another chance at another topper and see if we can pull a ring. So I'm excited for it, and uh, you know this is a, this is kind of a special opening to you know to pull all of these all these toppers together. So, are we ready? Are we ready? Hopefully he didn't peek at these. No, they're sealed. They're sealed. We're good. We're good, guys. We have the pull tabs on there and all. We have our nice pyramid designs plant. Let's use a pull tab. Uh, no, no, we're not using the pull tab. That was a horrendous idea. Horrendous idea. Pyramid Designs playmat here. Gandalf going towards... What in the world? Green Dragon in. Okay, it's great. I love this card so much. Gain control of your own. Uh, but what in the world is that? Like, what is that damage? So that's not good. It's definitely a damage like fold there. So we got the green dragon in. We got green dragon. And let's see, this one hopefully feels a little bit better in terms of quality and no dam yeah, no damage on this one. This one better be the Balin's tomb. Bag end. Nice. Nice. Beautiful bag end. Um, these two are some of the lower ones. Um, that you can possibly get. So, let's go for number three. This is what you guys are here for. I know it, right? You guys are here for, uh, realms and relics. Relics and realms. We got the realms so far. Alright, you ready? What do we think this is? Party tree? Ooh, into the prancing pony foil. Add one mana, spend this mana only to cast a multicolored spell. Okay. Again, so far these are these are three of the lowest tier. Um, this is kind of what happens when you do this, though, right, guys? All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Ready? Balin's tomb. Paths of the dead. Nice, nice. That's a hit right there, folks. That's a hit. Nice. Cavern of Souls. So that one is well worth, um, well worth what we did here today. Well worth. And we only had one damage, right? The first one was damaged. So we got one more relics and realms, and then we are going to head into the set box and try to grab a ring. So obviously we want this to be party tree, Balin's tomb, anything like that would be wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Can we get a party tree or Balin's tomb? Helm's deep. I still need it. So that's great. I'm trying to collect them all. So how do we do? We probably came close to break even, right? So Paths of the Dead, I think, is around 60 or so for this. Uh, Helm's Deep's around 15, so we're at 75. Green Dragon ends in around another 15, so that puts us around, you know, 90. Bag ends, 10, 100. And Inn of the Prancing Pony might be another 10 or so. So that puts us right around 110, which is right where right where we needed to be for what we, what we bought in at. We... But we did get them at a good price. Usually these things are going at like, I don't know, $28 or so on eBay. So we did get a good price. Um, this sleeve looks horrendous. Um, we're just going <laughs> to, we'll flop that out there. Very good. So excellent. Um, again, this was, this was super fun. So now let's get on to the party here. We got one more Relics and Realms too. And then we are going pure ringage right because remember in this base set for lord of the rings not the special edition just we'll call it base unlimited um you get bow masters which is like a 50 dollar card or so you get um you know the realms and relics topper which you can have a chance at 200 or so with a with a balance tomb or the ring which is really the the driver of a lot of value there's a couple other cards like mithril coat and things like that that are going to go for 10 um we're just on a roll with the with the topper so normally i wait but we're just going to try for a sixth topper here and boom that's gilliath core haven okay 
Not bad. Look at that thing. Glitter and shine, though. Beautiful. Beautiful car. This is probably another 15 or so for something like that. So we got Osgiliath, and we are going to move forward searching for the one ring. Palantir. Slip on the ring. The gift. You can't pass. Obviously, the Nazgul, too, are, are worth something. Rangers. And a couple things in foil. But nothing, nothing too crazy. Smaug. There's a couple commons, uncommon, still worth something. You got Reprieve, which is doing okay. You got Lorien Revealed, uh, Cast and Fire. All of those are are pretty solid. Morgul Knife Wound. We got Escape, Butterbur, Rosie, Bats, Shadow of the Enemy. Okay. In the Bath Song. Oh, Phyrexian Colossus. A eight life to untap. Cannot be blocked by fewer than three creatures. What a powerhouse, huh? Kinda. Kinda. It's just uh, expensive for an 8-8 eight eight with uh, an ability to untap. So, good for defense. It's pretty nice. Planes. Treason. Grand. Many partings. The ring goes south to a Shire Shriff. Shriff. Hey, Shriff. Island foil. Okay. Cast into the fire. That's the one we said. Aomer. Prince. Gothmog. Press the... I feel like we constantly get press the enemy. That's not what you want to see. That's pretty horrendous. That's from... Uh, Innistrad double uh, feature. Gray. Haunt. Chance met elves. Bilbo. Elrond, Master of Healing. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? Mount Doom. Troll. Troll and Lorien are actually two others, right? Troll and Lorien. So, some D and Reprieve. This was a nice value pack. Shelob and a bow. Nice little value pack. That just really ripped right open. Okay. Forest. Hooray. Spiteful. No, oh, oh, oh. My, not doom. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that's a heck of a pack here, folks. Spiteful, you know, seven bucks or so. Mount Doom, another seven bucks or so. Mithril Coat, ten bucks. So we're looking at a nice 24 um, in value on that pack. That was excellent. You want to see that every day of the week, except you want to see that borderless as a ring. So it's playful banditry. Okay. We well, got the swamp. Elven Farsight. Roto Baggins, Samwise, Foray. Forge anew, about 250 for that. March from the Black Gate. We really need that ring. The ring is what we want. Swamp. Entish Restoration is another uncommon that's pretty good. Fire Inscription and Ring Sight. Legolas. Oh, Flame of the West. I'm not sure what he's doing. Um, it should be a pretty good one, actually. It's a That's a pretty powerful card. I played in a draft match once, and I drafted that. It was pretty wild. So, that was definitely fun. Gifts, Horses, Elvish Mariner, Aragorn Company Leader, and some Bravery. Okay. Forest. Bag end. Enraged Hjorn. Book. Lash. Archer. Quarrels. End. And we're moving. All right. Shower of Arrows. Revive. Rangers. Gandalfs. Rosies. Moria Marauders. Invasive Surgery. Nothing crazy there. Entish Restoration. That's what I'm telling you about there. Nazgul. Nice from the 100. Good old first Nazgul. Frodo, Sauron's Bane. Faramir. And Arbiter. Players can't search libraries. Any player but ignore the effect. Okay. The two drop kind of... Players can't search libraries. Pretty potent. Pretty potent stuff. 
Golems. Stone. Stone's playable. Bath Song. Flame of Anora. That's a nice uh, couple bucks. Arwens and Shared Fate. Pretty awesome. I don't know what Shared Fate's doing, but I expect it's actually pretty decent. Maybe cut. Maybe two, three. Two or three. Right. Swamp. Took. Rise. Voracious. Nasty. The Shire. All your font. And we're ring hunting here, guys. We are ring hunting. Claim the precious. Stern. The Watcher in the Water. And claim the precious. Watcher in the Water. Uh, even in posters, not that great. Just not that great. How many Kraken deck players are out there? Wos. Celeborn. Hey, Yomer. Hey, Yomer. Gifts a strand. Hey, Yomer. Or is it Yomer? Westfold. Mirkwood. Assault on Osgiliath, Shagrat, and Hobbit's Sting. Yeah. This is a fun set to open, though. It really is. I love Lord of the Rings. Swampies. Rush. Uglik. Baradur. Baradur. Couple bucks on Baradur. Ooh, stone foil. I'm just gonna slip those out. We already saw that, so a little uh little cheat. Gimli, many, and the Battle of Bywater. That's not what you want to see. I saw it heat up a little bit. We're a little light on mythics though, so we do stand a chance at getting a ring still, I believe. Relentless, a Yomer. Grey Havens, Goldberry. Grim. Okay. You don't have any cards in your hand. That's a pretty good card. Oh, I had the Sig on it. Nice old Sig. Provised Oath. Oliphant. King of the Oathbreakers. That is not good. Not good at all. Mountain. Aragorn, the Uniter. A couple bucks. That's one, another one of the... Uh, Another one of the mythics down for the count, unfortunately, though. Okay. Foil. Reprieve. Dunland. Display of power. Sold a couple displays today. Uh, they don't go for very much. We're a little in, we're in a little trouble, guys. We haven't pulled a bowmaster or a ring. This is uh this is a little rough. Pippin, Stew, Schiff, Mournful Avenger, and some Grey Havens. Okay. We're in a we're in a little bit of a trouble piece here, guys. We're in some trouble. We are in trouble. Islands. Escape. Cast. Dunland. Ring sight. Rivendell. Wall of granite. Can't attack. Big old wall for three though. You don't see a lot of red walls. Right. Great Havens, Chance Met, Gond, Faramir, Rangers, Smite. Uh oh, guys. Coming down to the end, this is going to be the biggest comeback ever if we pull a ring. Troll, Lorien, Peregrine Took, Ring goes south. Bad, bad guys. Two packs left. It's gonna be the greatest comeback ever. Greatest comeback ever. Give it to us. Generous Ent. Bitter Downfall. Frodo. Saruman the White Hand. Gandalf the White and Frodo. Sauron's. Oh. Okay. It's not a bad card. Not too shabby. Okay. 
Elven Farsight. Galadrim, this is it, guys. Barrow Blade, Frodo Baggins, Lash of the Balrog, Press the Enemy, and Caliborn. Oh, what an awful way to end it. Phrases up on the screen as usual. We are about 147 in on this box, and uh, I don't think we came close. Osgiliath, uh, Corhaven isn't going to get us there, that's for sure. So, thanks for checking it out. Enjoyed the, uh, enjoyed the opening at the beginning, too, with all of our realms and relics, and just look at how nice that path looks. So, yeah, again, that was really fun. I'm going to try to keep doing that if I can, you know, whenever I find them. So thanks again, everybody. Check out my Patreon, check out my Discord. And again, thanks to all the patrons out there. I very much appreciate you guys. We'll talk to you all later.